In 2009, I was a high school senior. What happened is I went to work out. After my workout, I felt good, but eventually, a few hours later, I had a, a lot of back pain. Went to sleep. The next day, I woke up, had a loss of sensation in my legs, and over a two-week course, um, I uh, lost the ability to walk and to uh, feel below the waist. Scott was diagnosed with a cavernous hemangioma in the middle of his back. It spontaneously burst open, and when it did, it damaged his spinal cord in the same way that an accident or trauma would. I was a football player, and I was uh, a member of our high school team for three years, and I got some recruiting letters to play for some smaller colleges in Ohio. After being paralyzed from the waist down, Scott's dreams of playing college football were dashed. But with the help of family and friends, he's been able to keep a positive attitude and has actively sought out the best care possible. I spent some time out in California at a, at a spinal cord facility and when I came back home to Toledo, I did a random Google search and looked for spinal cord injury facilities in this area and I found a rim. Fong Vu, senior physical therapist at the Detroit Medical Center's Rehabilitation Institute of Michigan, has been working with Scott using cutting-edge technology called the EXO, a robotic exoskeleton that allows wheelchair users to stand and walk. This robotic suit can be used for those who have had a recent spinal cord injury or an injury that happened many years ago. With Fong's help, Scott has set some goals for his recovery. He wants to try to um, get any type of motor function back in his lower extremities without the use of any type of bracing, which are the knee ankle foot orthoses that basically lock out your knees and doesn't allow for any type of motor return. So this is the best option for Scott because we use it for uh, neuromuscular re-education. So where we have him focusing on taking steps uh, as natural as possible. Getting his hip flexors to turn on, trying to think about getting the quads, the hamstrings to fire at the exact time that it would normally be during a step. So EXO allows for all of that because the EXO takes the step, it, you bend the hips, bend the knees, and then you plant the foot, just like you do in normal gait. All right, here we go. Shift to the left, first step on the right, and three, two, one. Okay, shift right, good. It's amazing, you know, be, when I started, we didn't have all of this technology, and the patient really relied on us therapists and clinicians to be able to hold them up to reproduce these steps. And again, it's physically labor intensive on the patient, the clinicians, and again, we can't always last like the EXO. For over a year I've been in EXO and I've improved from walking with a walker with EXO to now walking with crutches, which is really cool. Physical therapist Shelley Dennis has been working in the field for many years and has seen patients take great strides in their therapy using the EXO at Rehabilitation Institute of Michigan, which is the only facility in Michigan to have this high-tech piece of equipment. The thing that's cool is it's new. It helps get people walking. That's what they want to do. You know, they come to PT after they've been paralyzed for whatever the circumstance. This is real walking. Traditional therapy, you're working on what we call compensatory techniques. In other words, a client's had an injury, you're teaching them to live with that injury, help them get better and improve and leave the door open for what the future holds. We're the future. When I'm here, I have a lot of confidence that I'm you know, working out with the best and I'm training with the best devices. Stand the left, there you go. There's still hope. The best thing to do is to call us. It doesn't hurt, you know, to come and give it a try. And with all the technology that they're developing now, maybe in the near future, um, you know, who knows what that next step is. To learn more about the EXO or to schedule an appointment at the Rehabilitation Institute of Michigan, log on to dmc.org or call 313-745-9932. I'm Emory King.